Hey y'all, it's your girl Ray, back again with another wig adventure. So, if you are like me, you keep buying new wigs before you wear your old wigs, and the common sense in me is saying, girl, wear your wigs. So, I'm pulling out wigs that I have not worn yet that I bought, and I don't even know when I bought this wig, and that's a shame. But, I found it, I need a wig to go out in, and we're going to try this wig on together. So... First of all, I wanted y'all to see the braid pattern, honey. Because, you know, I'm always doing the, this video with my wig grip cap on. But my lovely daughter-in-law braided my hair for me. So this is how I wear my hair probably 90% of the time underneath the wig cap. I know there's a lot of TikToks going around about, I forget the name of the wig cap, but honey, this good old Amazon wig cap works perfectly. Now, mind you, I had this one a while. It's probably time to get a new one. But literally, this is what I do. I put on the wig cap and I velcro the back and your girl's ready to put her wigs on. It covers all of your hair. It has the lace in the middle. This is a little frayed. Don't judge me. It's a little old, but it works. Okay. So today's wig y'all is a dark plum wig and I don't think I've ever worn dark plum before, but we're going to wear it today. So this is the wig y'all. Let me just show you. Woo! Look at this color. The color, the color, the color is rich. So I bought this when Love Me was doing this huge sale and it had all these different wigs for different prices. So I don't know when that was, y'all. But bottom line is, this is a dark plum. It is a loose wave, as you can see. It's 20 inches, okay? It is five by five lace. It is HD. Let me turn this on the other side so that you can see the five by five lace. It does have the adjustable straps, which I do not like, y'all, but it is what it is. It has a comb in the back. Let me see. And a comb in the middle. Now, mind you, with this, you don't need any combs. But for those of you that use combs, it's in there. The other thing about this wig is it does not have the adjustable strap. I like the adjustable strap, y'all. So this right here, I'm not going to like this because this gets loose. And then the wig gets a little loose. But whatever. We're going to go with it because it's already there, right? Um, so this is the Dark Plum Loose Wave. 5x5 five five HD Lace, 20 inches. It is 180 density. And I've never worn this color before, y'all. So we're going to see. So let's try this wig on. And let's see how your girl looks. Okay. So you know me, I got to put the wig on and I got to fix it, so. Okay. This is different. <laughs> I have never worn, I don't think I've worn a dark plum wig, and I don't know how I feel about it. And it might be this light in my room that's making it look super bright, but... This is the wig. You can see the part. Curls. It's probably these curls, baby, because the curls ain't it. I'm going to have to brush these out or something. But this is the wig. I will definitely have to tighten the adjustable um, hooks on the back because it's, it's tight, but it's not as tight as I like it. But, you know, I can catch the spirit and the wig don't fall off. <laughs> so this is the dark plum, y'all. This is 20 inches. I needed a wig to go out in tonight, and I don't know if this is going to be it, y'all. We're going to see. Of course, I have to cut the lace, tint it, brush out these curls. But we're going to see what this wig is doing, okay? So here is the beginning. This is 20 inches, dark plum, loose wave, um, 180 density. It does feel like 180 density. It feels pretty much thicker than 150 and yeah I might need to wash this and rewind it but y'all know I'll be wearing my wig straight out the box for the most part just to keep the curl even though this curl I could probably do without so I will do this wig up and we're gonna see how this wig turns out everybody this is my first time trying a dark plum this is a little bit of getting used to you know I'm usually a brown girl a highlight girl a blonde girl but we got to do something different right we got to keep these men on their toes so stay tuned i will cut the lace tint it and come back and we're gonna see what the wig looks like 
All right, thanks for joining me. All right, y'all, this is the finished product. Oof. Okay, when I first put this wig on, I wasn't really feeling it. I don't know what it was. But after tinting the lace, combing out the curls, this plum is bomb on my skin. Who said brown girls can't wear every color? I don't know if you can see the richness of this plum, but it's cute. It is cute. I actually want to see what this looks like if I flat ironed it like straight and if I did like a little crimp curl, but baby, this is giving. I think I've subscribed so long to the notion that brown girls can only wear certain colors that like, I don't know, I just wore browns and, and natural blacks, but this is the season, honey, to do color. This is beautiful. Look at this rich color. This looks great on my skin. Wow. Okay. I have been converted, y'all. Another wig adventure that has been successful. Look at this color. Look at how deep this plum is. It is giving. It is giving everything. This is a wig adventure that was a success. This is definitely a must-buy. The cap is snug. The lace tinted good. I probably will use my melting uh, spray on this lace to really make it disappear. But for what it is giving, honey, just off of a couple of things, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. So, thank you for joining me on another wig adventure. This plum wig, I don't know if it's still offered on the website. I will double check, but I will put the link in the description box if it is. Y'all, this is a must buy. This is a must buy. I love this dark plum. All right, well, thank you for joining me. Stay tuned for another wig adventure with your girl, Ray, and you have a great day.